Hello and welcome to another sprint. I'm very excited this time around because uh, we are on the in the final stretches. This is the current milestone. I am starting early because in this week I'm going to be at Castle Game Jam. So I have to push my sprint a little bit earlier. It's not June yet, but this is the June sprint. And I'm very excited. Learn Mode is the name of the app that I'm going to be working on. And in fact, on today's stream I'm going to be designing. I need to plan what kind of content will go into the tutorial, which I already know, and the pixel art fundamentals, which is going to be what will come out by the end of the year, approximately. But right now, our goal is to create our learn mode app that shows you this kind of a breakdown of all of the goals. So as always, let's jump ahead one week and see where we got. Well, a week has passed. It's been a little bit of a shorter work week, but yeah, we got something going on. Let's take a look. Here we are. Here is the new Learn Mode app running. And if we go in, we get this little, uh, little, little introduction section. Welcome to Learn Mode, blah, blah, blah. Some stuff ready to begin. Start learning and, well, that's not supposed to be there. And then we get to this screen that shows us all the content we have in the whole thing. Also, as always, this needs to be tested, so we'll see, we'll see how people understand. But here it shows you what kind of apps you have available. And then, uh, this probably won't work, let's find out. When you click Unlock, oh, it does work, wow. Uh, so I did code it completely, I just haven't tested it. This 100% uh, means that I've done this, but actually I would need to see. So there's a bunch of stuff to fix. All right, we've done some coding on the streamer just now, so uh, we have some more working. We have a little icon for the lock. Here we go. Now you can actually see just by looking at it that uh, some apps are still locked and it also tells you what you need to do to unlock the app. So let's try and unlock the drawing app. We gotta go into the study plan and complete this start study plan goal. Here we see that we have on uh, we made the drawing app able to unlock. So we click on it, get back to the screen, and there we go. And so let's uh, work hard this week, uh, and uh, we'll see where we get on the end of the sprint. Hello, this is a little bit different start of this uh, week or I guess end of the previous end of the sprint because uh, yeah, as you can see, I'm not, in, I'm not inside as usually. I am here at this beautiful castle in Latvia, uh, here for the castle game jam. So the sprint, I had to cut it a little bit short because uh, yeah, I was gonna had to travel to Latvia and so, um, but it's almost 10, it's super bright still because uh, this is high alt latitudes. And uh, yeah, so I'm gonna, it's almost done. I'm gonna go uh, start the stream now where I'm gonna record the rest of the uh, review, sprint review. So uh, yeah, let's, let's head inside into the darkness. All right, here we are. Let me show you uh, the new learn mode. Uh, all the new stuff that I haven't shown last time. Look at that. We have completed almost everything. We are at 97% completion. So all of this now works. Uh, let's turn off completionist mode first of all. Then it's automatically just showing you the, you know, these things that can be expanded. It just collapses them if you've done everything because you don't care really. You know, if you're not a completionist, you just need to see what's the only thing that I haven't done. If you do enable completionist mode, yeah, you can see then all the other stuff turns back on that you haven't done. Even though you've completed drawing challenges, drawing challenges has, let's hover over this, has 29 artworks to complete. I made it so that completing this goal puts very little towards the end because I don't want to make you, oh, like make this very important. So you're at 97% already if you just do one. I think this is just one. So let's complete one just for the sake of it. And this pixel up here, there we go. Let's see how our percentage raised. Yeah, there you have it. And now we have 70% of small monochrome. This one is seven. We're still at 97% there because we would have to quite, yeah, complete quite many of this. But you know, so completionist, maybe you'll do one sprite every time. You'll get to know a lot of indie games and see how other artists think. So that's learn mode. Yeah. I'm super excited now. It's just the sort of fun stuff uh, of uh, all the content is in, but now the polish starts to make audio, to make music. But yeah, this is it for this sprint. Thank you for uh, the journey, sharing it. Bye bye. Cheers. 
Well, I am back from Castle Game Jam, back in Sweden, back at Spell Collective, and uh, yeah, you, I thought the video would end here, but I have, I have some more things I have to say on the topic. I had a playtest of the current version that I just showed you. Yeah, it's it. The playtest confirmed some hunches that I had that it might be that the Learn Mode app, not entirely, but in very similar fashion, covers the same ground as study plan so which means that it's a little bit redundant and a little bit confusing because you have two apps that are both showing you progress so today before i move on to the next sprint i will attempt to redesign how the whole ux experience could look like if i were to throw the player straight on into the drawing experience perhaps even skipping study plan itself and keeping that just for adventure mode or opening it up, only unlocking it later if things become more non-linear. So that's it for this devlog. Thank you for coming by. Thanks for any likes and subscriptions and all the good stuff. See you next time. Bye-bye.